Now let us discuss about SQL operators in, not in, between, not between and like operators. First let us see about in operator. In operator is mainly useful in order to check whether a value is in a list of values or not, a collection of values or not. If the value is in that list, then the corresponding row will be displayed. Suppose if the value is not in the list, then the row won't be displayed. Let us see with the help of an example. In keyword, in operator, so, uh, here we have a table called EMP table. EMP table totally contains four columns, employee number, name, address and salary. Here we have four records. First record is one. Ramesh, Hyderabad, 25,000 is the salary. Second record, 2, Mahesh, Delhi, 20,000 is the salary. 3, Naresh, Mumbai, 35,000 is the salary. 4, Suresh, Chennai, 50,000 is the salary. Uh, let's say this for you. Select star from EMP where address, here the address totally contains 4 values. Okay. In where address in list of values. So let us place those values within the quotations. We can use either single quotation or double quotation. Uh, first value is Delhi, comma. Second value is Chennai. Here, what is the column here? Address. So this is the column here. So Delhi is available here. So this row will be displayed. Next, Chennai is available here. So this row will be displayed. So it will totally displace two rows. First column is employee number. Second column is name. Third column is address. Fourth column is salary. So first it displays the second record. Why? Because here the address is Delhi. So two, Mahesh, Delhi, 20,000. Next record, uh, here for the fourth record, uh, address is Chennai. Okay, here we have Chennai. So this record will also be displayed. 4, Suresh, Chennai and 50,000. So this is the output. So this is the advantage of in operator, in keyboard, in operator. It is useful in order to check whether a column or a value is available in the list of values or not. The list of values are separated by comma. Each value is enclosed within the quotation. Okay. Uh, so here, Delhi, Chennai is available in two places here. So second record and fourth record will get displayed. Uh, now let us see about not in. So the next operator is not in. So in play before in, let us use not keyword. So not space in. Not space in. Select star from EMP where address not in Delhi Chennai. So second record contains Delhi, fourth record contains Chennai. So these two records won't be displayed. So now what will happen? The first record will be displayed as well as third record will be displayed. Why? Because here the condition is address not in. Okay. So Delhi is not uh, here we have Hyderabad. Here we have Chennai. Okay. Here we have Mumbai. So this first record as well as third record will be displayed here. Now let us see about between. So between is used in order to display the records between uh, two values, some minimum value and maximum value, okay. Uh, let us see an example, select star from EMP where salary is between 30,000 and 50,000. So mainly we use this between, in between the numerics, in between the numerics, it may be integers or floating point numbers. Where sal is between 30,000 and, so here we must use, when we are using between keyword, here in operator, between operator and like operator use, is used in where class. We have here select class, from class, where class. Here we use as in, not in, between, not between and like in where class. Okay. So where uh, here if we are using between then we must use under also, under keyword also, under operator also. Where sal is between 30,000 and 50,000. Sal means this column. So here the minimum value is 30,000, maximum value is 50,000. So we have two records where the salary is between 
30,000 to 50,000. That is 35,000 and 50,000. So we will get these two records as the output. 3 Naresh Mumbai 35,000. 4 Suresh Chennai 50,000. We will get those two records. Now we can use not between also. Where sal not between 30,000 and 20,000. Okay. So that means salary should not be between 30,000 and 50,000. So we have two records where the salary is not between 30,000 to 50,000. So those are 25,000 and 20,000. So these two salaries are not between 30,000 and 50,000. So what will happen? The first two, two records will be displayed. One Ramesh, Hyderabad 25,000. Two Mahesh, Delhi 20,000. So these two records will be displayed. Now let us see about in is over, between is over. Now let us see about uh, like. Like is mainly useful in order to display the strings for pattern matching. So here we have to display the record based on the pattern matching. Here mainly we use just two patterns. Percentage or underscore. Percentage or underscore. Here we are going to search the patterns based on these two symbols. Percentage underscore. So underscore means it matches with only one character. Whereas percentage means it matches with zero or one or multiple characters. So zero or many number of characters. So percentage means zero or more number of characters. Whereas underscore means only one character. So let us see an example here. Uh, it is a single quotation A percentage. So it displays the records where the string starts with A and after A we can have any number of uh, characters. We can have any number of characters. It may be one character or two character or three character, any number of characters. Let us see one more example. Percentage A. So here it displays the records where the string ends with A. Where the string ends with A. Before A we have percentage. Percentage means zero or any number of uh, uh, occur zero or any number of occurrences. So zero A's means Nothing. Okay. One A or we can have two A's or three A's or four A's. Okay. Next one underscore A. So it displays the records where the second position is the second position character is A. First position we can we can have any character. It may be any character. But here the second position is A. After A we can have any number of characters. Okay. So second position in the character is A. First position is only one character, it may be any character and after that we can have any number of records. Now let us see some examples. Select star from EMP. Select star from EMP where, where name like, where name like, is it a single quotation or we can use double quotation also. Percentage ESH. Percentage ESH where name name means what this column here we are performing the pattern searching based upon the name column so we need to select one column where name like so what is the condition here ESH so the corresponding name ends with ESH so before ESH we have percentage percentage means any number of characters it may be zero or one or any number of characters so if we take Ramesh, it is ending with ESH. If you take Mahesh, it is ending with ESH. If you take Naresh, it is ending with ESH. If you take Suresh, it is also ending with ESH. So all the four records will be displayed. So the entire table will be displayed. Okay. So let us assume that uh, here, uh, uh, let me have underscore here. Let the first character is underscore. Uh, next, let we have A here. And after that, we have percentage here. So underscore A percentage. So here the second the second character is A. So before A we have we must have only one character. After A we can have any number of characters. If you take Ramesh, the second character is A. Before A we, we are having R. After A we can have any number of characters. So first record will be displayed. If you take Mahesh, second character is A. Before A we have one character. After A, we can have any number of characters. There is no constraint on that. Second character is A in Naresh. Before A, we have N. Only one character. After A, we are having RESH. There is no problem. Any number of characters. Suresh. But here the second character is 
you. So this row won't be displayed. So if we use this uh, this uh, uh, this pattern, then what will happen? The first three records will be displayed. The first three records will be displayed. Now let us take one more condition. Uh, let the let here uh, we have percentage next uh, five thousand. Let here the column is sand. So select start from ERP where sal is like. So percentage means we can have any number of characters, but it should end with five thousand. It should end with five thousand. So it is ending with five thousand. So before five thousand we have two. Here it is also ending with five thousand. Before five thousand we have three. Here we can use percentage or we can use underscore also. Percentage means zero or one or any number of any occurrences. So what will happen? This first row as well as this third row will be displayed. Okay. Why? Because here the uh, here uh, twenty five thousand means it is ending with five thousand. Thirty five thousand means it is ending with five thousand. So likewise we can write uh, n number of patterns. Uh, so let the uh, uh, let here we have underscore. Let uh, second character is also underscore. Uh, let the next one is uh, let the next one is yam. And after that let we have percentages. After that we have percentages. Let here the column name is bear name. So here the third character is yam. Third character is yam. So first and second characters, maybe any other characters. And after yam we can have any number of characters. So third character is yam. So in Ramesh, what is the third character? Yam. So before yam, before yam we have uh, before yam we have two characters, two characters, and after that any number of characters. So the first row will be displayed, and third character is H. So this row won't be displayed. Third character is R. This row won't be displayed. Third character is R. So this row won't be displayed. Suppose if the third character is R, then what will happen? This third row as well as fourth row will be displayed. Why? Because in Narayan, third character is R. In Suresh, third character is R. So third record and fourth record will be displayed. So this is about in, not in, between. Not between and bike operators.